It has been such an active year, so much so that 2024 is now fifth wettest year to date. But how does that impact our summer temperatures? Well, out of the top 15 wettest springs on record, only two of the following were above normal, bringing the average 100 degree days to only 12 other years. It's closer to about 20. Now, since 1950, all of the top 15 wettest springs happened during El Nino or neutral conditions which we are currently in El Nino transitioning to neutral conditions. So why does this lead to a cooler summer? Well, it is because solar energy is used to evaporate the wet ground instead of heating the dry ground. Uh, and as the water evaporates, it creates a mild cooling effect similar to how sweat cools off the body.